This is the longtime mobile home of Lillian Daniel. She recently moved it just over the past few weeks to this mobile home park off 40 Highway, but you can hear the generator back here. There's no electricity and there's no water either. Water into buckets is the way Emma Bridges is giving her 80 year old mother Lillian an opportunity to flush toilets and boil water inside her mobile home. A generator runs nonstop too for power. And we've got this mess. Lillian Daniels yeah. has lung cancer. What's it like to live in a global pandemic without running water? Oh, you don't want to do it. <laughs> Daniels just moved to the Hart Mobile Village, but says management and maintenance have not been able to hook up water or electricity to her trailer. She paid to have the trailer here. With the assumption we're going to have utilities. Shouldn't she? Called while I try to connect you. KBC 9 News called management for the park several times Monday to get answers. The property manager said she was calling her boss, but never called back. I wear dentures. I can't put my dentures in because I have to rely on the kids to warm up the water, to brush my teeth, to give them to me, because I'm still not quite confident in handling hot water. As COVID-19 looms, the 55 gallon drum remains on the porch to keep hauling water in as her daughter also has to keep refilling the generator. Matt Fleener, KNBC 9 News.